Oh, go on, go on. Oh, how good was that? Oh my word. Got goosebumps, I actually got goosebumps. <laughs> hey, I'm a jazzy golfer. I'm a golf presenter and very amateur golfer who is passionate about getting more women and juniors into golf. I fell in love with this game on a family holiday over four years ago and since embarking on my journey in the industry, it has been my mission to show how this amazing game can be enjoyed by everyone. And as you may have noticed, I'm not too hard to spot because I'm always wearing something jazzy. I'm travelling over from the UK to attend the KPMG Women's PGA Championship in Atlanta, Georgia. It'll be my first time ever watching a women's major in the US and I'll be following Atlanta's own Mariah Stackhouse as she competes in front of her hometown crowd. It feels really good to be at home actually. It's already more fun because I'm at home, I'm staying in my own bed so there's just a more relaxed feeling which I think will translate onto the course and I want to gravitate towards that more so than putting uh, putting demands in my head. I just want to be free. So that's how I'm approaching the week. But you see what I'm saying? Like I feel like driving off the deck is just fine here because you end up right here. Then you just got a little bump and run chip. Easy. The slope just propels it right up. Yeah. The slope literally sits it to toss right into the air. 144 front. Okay. Well, we got ping. Speeds are a little different than what I've been practicing, actually a little slower. This is one of the best courses in Atlanta. And so, you know, with this week being a major, you feel like you gotta take it seriously, uh, study the course, really know uh, every bit of it. So now that we've been out here a few times, I feel like today particularly felt like the most relaxing major practice round that I've had. For the hard there. <laughs> Home game, babe. That's up. Uh... So here we are, we made it to the KPMG Women's PGA Championship and I could not be more excited to be here. So we're gonna head off to the course now and watch some of the great players in action. Oh, that's a shot. Nice. This course is in such great condition. I've never seen anything like it. It's pristine. Oh, shot. That was a cracking shot. Oh, go on. Go on, go on, go on, go on, go on, go on, go on. Go on. Oh, oh. Water is my absolute nemesis, so this is not a jasmine hole at all. Look at that. No, thank you. Oh, what a shot. Okay, no one else claps, just me. <laughs> so nice. There's so many young girls here with their dads. And it's just so nice to see young girls watching the best players in the world play golf and hopefully if they aren't already playing golf they'll be picking it up because of this. So sweet. You guys are both following Mariah. Is she someone you've been looking up to for a while? Yeah, she has. Amazing. She's really one of my main inspirations. Oh really? Oh, she fantastic. actually has a picture. Oh, let me see. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, how old were you there? That was a while ago. Yeah, I was eight. Oh, nice. Show that to the camera because that is a lovely photo. Welcome to the first team from Riverdale, Georgia, Mariah Stackhouse. What's it like now of having seen Mariah grow up and obviously become a fantastic member of the LPGA? I think it is amazing and I'm just so proud of her because she came from our community yeah, yeah and I just love it and she's um, homegrown and she's from Atlanta yeah and yeah. I am so excited. So as Mariah's dad, I mm. hear that you are the person that got her into golf. Uh, tell, us, tell us how that came about. Um, well, I was an avid golfer and uh, she was a, a kind of a daddy's girl. Yeah. She took to it pretty well. Yeah. Mariah was a pretty smart girl, so she, you know, this is being a thinking person's game, yeah. uh, she picked up on it pretty quickly. And what's it like for you, you know, obviously, a major in, a, in Atlanta. What's that like as her dad watching her play in this great event? That's kind of hard to believe. I, yeah. You know, this is just one of those things I guess you do, that you don't see coming. Mm. Okay, so it's the Monday after the KPMG Women's PGA and what an event that was. The atmosphere was electric. There were so many juniors. Mariah made the cut. 
she came tied 33rd, and Nelly Corder won her first ever major and made it to world number one. So just in case this week wasn't big enough for Mariah, she is co-hosting an event with legend of the game, Renee Powell on Monday, which we've been kindly invited to. So it's gonna be a really, really fun day. I'd love for you to tell me just a little bit more about, you know, what Renee means to you and also what this event means to you. Oh man, um, you know, for me personally, Renee means so much. She is the definition of a golf ambassador. First of all, I want to welcome everyone here today. Thank you all so much for being here. <laughs> 75 years ago, long before I was born, my father, my father designed and built Clearview Golf Course. Because of the fact he wanted to, to give everybody an opportunity to play this game of golf. In 2001, the Clearview Golf Course was placed on the National Register of Historic Places. And at the same time, we formed the Clearview Legacy Foundation for Education, Preservation, and Turfgrass Research. And so, here we are today to help create awareness, raise funds, and that's exactly what this event is doing. You know, the second black woman to play on the LPGA Tour is personally an inspiration for me. Mm -hmm. And you literally paved the way for myself and the others that have come after. And so I just have such a huge respect for you as a person, as an athlete, you're a rock star. To be a part of this event here in Atlanta, my home city, um, and where I was raised as a junior golfer, um, it truly feels like that full circle moment. Thank you all very much for being here and uh, being a part of all of this. <laughs> We spoke to quite a few young juniors who said that you were an inspiration for them, just as Renee has been an inspiration for you. So how important are events like this today? I think events like this are incredibly important because what they're doing is bridging generations. We're showing what has been achieved by Renee, you know, golfers like myself who are currently out there doing it, and the young ones to be able to see what that journey can look like. I'm really happy to see all of you here today. I know that Miss Renee has a fantastic clinic set up for you all today, and I really hope that you enjoy this experience, getting to learn from one of our living legends right now, and so soak up the moment. Ask all the questions you can, and really enjoy every bit of this experience. Nice. And what did we say we were going to do a little tick-tock, tick-tock. And we're going to move from here. Just move our arm. Tick-tock, tick-tock. OK, just line up like that. Oops. Flat on the ground. It's in. It's in. Oh. Oh. We have some stars coming up here. All of this is helping to create uh, more awareness and to show girls that here are girls that look like you, and this can be done. And then the other thing is that, that Michelle Wee West yeah. has, my gosh, this hoodie project has yeah. been amazing. And I think only for the last couple of months, and they've sold over 10,000 wow. hoodies. Those benefit two charities. Half of the money goes to the LPGA, and the other half of the money is going to the Clearview Legacy Foundation. Loving your swing. Thank you. Really Did well. Did you see mine? I wrote all the way to that white flag. No way. You can watch. All right, soft hands. Pretend that there's an egg in your hand and you're trying not to break it. Wow. How good is that? They're going to leave here, hopefully today, newly inspired um, and with bigger dreams that they had when they first showed up today. And that's, uh, that's what Renee has done for so many. And I want to follow in those footsteps and be uh, to, the, to the generation of golfers coming behind what she has meant to me. Thank you for recording me. I know you all must be impressed. Ha, 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 ha.